hey guys welcome back to technopathy channel so in today's video we are going to see python error which is basically python is not recognized or peep is not recognized or you can say peep 3 is not recognized uh, kind of errors how to resolve that okay so in my case i have installed uh, python 3.8 on my system which is basically windows 10 and here if suppose if i type python it is not showing anything in your case it might uh, show that python is not recognized but in my case it is opening basically a microsoft store and asking me to install uh, get python 3.8 but i actually have installed it on my system so how to resolve that issue uh, so suppose if in pip if i type pip okay so it is showing uh, pip is not recognized okay so uh, in your case uh, uh, you might see the same thing same error with python command like uh, instead of pip it is showing python is not recognized so i am going to provide the uh, you the solution for both uh, these things okay so suppose if i type python hyphen v still it is not showing anything then if i type python uh, pip hyphen v it is uh, showing pip is not recognized so uh, now let me show you that uh, which python version i have installed so if i go to search and type python it is showing python 3.8 is installed and if i right click on it okay not sorry i want to find out the location right click on it and open file location so here as you can see python 8 is installed shortcut is there if i click on this it is opening shell and if i type uh, print anything uh, just I wanted to show you that Python is installed properly uh, hello and then it is showing uh, it is uh, executing this um, statement uh, properly that means Python is installed but still I am facing that issue okay so I will close this window so why this issue so basically you, uh, after installing Python uh, you have to add uh, a Python path in your environment variables that is in your system variable as well to recognize those commands uh, in your command prompt okay so for that you just need to add path in environment variables suppose you if you are trying to install python or reinstall python from start uh, in that case you can refer our previous video in that i have shown you how to install uh, python 3.8 or you can say uh, reinstall python, uh, python version or uh, change your ver version from 3.7 to 3.8 something like that so from scratch you can uh, ref, uh, to install python from scratch you can refer that specific video okay so now here how to add that uh, path in environment variable so simply um, type what environment search for environment variables type here environment variables it will show edit the system environment variables click on that in this click on environment variables then go to new uh, sorry not new in path select path and then click on edit uh, so here you have to add your environment variables path okay so where is that path how to find out that path so, suppose if you go inside your c folder and go usually files are stored in program files whatever you are downloading but here you as you can see in p python it is not showing anything so where is my python so if you try to search it will take lots of time instead of that what you what you can do type python it will show you application just right click on it then open file location not this location uh, you have to add uh, it, it is just shortcut so just click on that shortcut then right click on it and open file location of this shortcut so here is the actual python version uh, sorry python uh, executable files are installed okay so as you can see the uh, path is a uh, bit different okay this is not actual uh, program files uh, in c folder it is inside my directory app data and local and the actual path okay so here is that python uh, exe file so you have to add this path okay so click on here just copy this path and open your environment variables then click on new and paste it here then click on ok not only this you have to add in your system variables as well for that click on path you can simply click on edit or double click on this path then click on new and paste it here then click ok again ok and again ok okay then open your command prompt and now type python version okay it is not showing still not showing anything i have to restart this command prompt for that close it then type cmd open command prompt and now type python and press enter button so guys here you can see it is showing python 
8.2 now it is taking me inside the python shell i will exit this and let's see it is showing python version properly or not for python version yeah so it is showing python 3.8.2 previously it was showing empty okay so uh, let's check for pip for pip it is still showing pip is not recognized okay for pip 3 it is showing pip is not pip 3 is also not recognized okay so where are my executable files so in same uh, directory which I opened previously inside that go inside scripts here you can see pip3 is there pip is there uh, the previous versions of uh, uh, executables python executable executables which are easy install are there so copy this path you have to add this path as well now go to environment variables again okay go to environment variables then click on environment variables then go inside your path then edit and click on new just add this path here okay click on okay now restart your command prompt and type pip okay pip okay so now it is working fine pip hyphen v okay it is showing pip uh, version which is 19.2.3 and for pip 3 let's check for pip 3 as well and it is working for pip 3 also so for pi, uh, pip versions uh, you there is no need to add inside system variables like uh, for python we have added in uh, we, uh, what is this user variables for my name uh, which is environment variable and then system variables okay uh, so for pip just inst uh, add that path in this section and for python add in both that is system variables and the first portion as well so that's it guys in today's video if you like it if it is uh, you are able if this video help you to resolve your issue then please hit like button if you have any doubt you can ask in the comments section so please subscribe to our channel uh, we will uh, bring some new videos in upcoming days so bye bye